Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Sea Captain or whatever I am. I don't know. I'm going to just roll with it. Um, we just took care of- OH! No! I'm supposed to be a strong one here. Uh, it just took me by surprise and the lag. It really didn't help. I can't fight them all at once. I already lost two of my men. You guys are useless! Useless, I tell you! Oh, I lost a lot of my men. A lot. Oh god. Oh god, I hit one by mistake. Hey, you're not gonna mind. Okay, good. He doesn't mind. Oh no. I'm a pretty good archer. These guys are really. They, they were really unprepared. They were really incredibly unprepared. It just makes me feel bad. Badass! Oh god, I can't see anything. Oh god, there are two of them. protecting this so much. Like, they made an, a last stand when they were basically only wearing clothes. A last stand only wearing clothes. They didn't even have armor on. I mean, I expected humans to be more... Strong. That's the word. Strong. Why weren't they, like, normal humans? Like, I get that they're probably just as weak as those guys. Who is this wall here? Wait a minute. Is that lithium crystal? Oh, guys. I forgot to tell you in the last episode when I first mention this stuff, this stuff can fly if you don't try handle it correctly. And I... <laughs> yep, this stuff is definitely being held in place. I need more TNT. I'm gonna pause this video and be back with more TNT, guys. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, guys, um, this is a very big crystal, or... A very big shard of I, I just want to give you a small fact this world um, apparently used to have two suns one was called the red sun one was called the yellow sun <laughs> uh, it's funny but anyway um, yeah this world this is a shard of the red sun. And the red sun was the most powerful of them all. It was the highest because it had a gravity it had a crystal inside of it that changed gravity itself. That basically floated up instead of floating down. And it powered extreme devices. It was like it's really good at powering things. So when it blew up, when the star blew up, or the sun blew up, everybody started, um, well, that's when life was basically created, but every, once we realized how to use technology and stuff, we started using all this. 
And now this can be used for power, but what is it powering? That's what I'm worried about. I think there's really only one thing to do here. By the way, it's extremely sensitive and it powers anything from TNT to I'll just big Whoa! Oh my god. to stop me, huh? That, that human. Alright, where's the first piece gonna go? I think we should put it on the top to bottom. If this kills me, well then it kills me. But at least I'll be stopping partially. Why don't I just break the chains? I mean, this will be more fun, but... Wait, what? Why isn't this working? Oh, God. Okay. Wait, is there any water at the bottom of this? I mean, there's really only one thing to find out. Uh, this is gonna be um really scary incredibly scary I just need to run as soon as I hit this three two run 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 Oh god. It's the edge of the world. What? This is impossible. I thought the world was round. I mean, maybe those cuckoos were right back in back in the olden days. Maybe the world is flat. And it was just Oh wait. Uh, no. I don't know. Okay. I don't need two battle axes anymore. Right? Oh god. Oh god. Okay, 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 okay. I heard it blow. Is that the end? Okay. I'm a bit cold right now. I'm shivering, in fact. Uh, um, one chain is broken. And it's pretty much getting ready to float. It'll, it'll eventually float. Let's see what's at the bottom of this. Not a river. It's all blocked up by this stuff. What is this stuff? Well, all right. Hurt my ankle a little bit, but that's fine. I'm a pig, so it'll wear off in no time. If you didn't know that, mobs actually have more regenerative they're actually really, really, in, pretty much invulnerable. Humans break their limbs, mobs. Well, mobs just sort of hurt. They get hurt, and then they heal in a few days. 
That's why when you see a mob getting stabbed, they don't, re they don't, they, um, they sort of just brush it off like it's fine. When you see a human getting stabbed, like, it, that's not gonna work. Or maybe if they're tough and they have a lot of armor on, but most mobs just wear shirts and stuff. Humans actually wear armor. I mean, I said most, right? Never seen. Oh, I wish I could have seen those Nova. I mean, never mind. And might as well tell you guys. I mean, it's not like it's hurting anything. I was gonna talk about the Nova Creepers and how they. They were the first race to actually discover, um, discover armor, and they wore it with pride. They were awesome, and I wish I could have seen them. I mean, of course, every human knew about the doom, or every human knew about the battle. Ending of the great creeper civilization. It was a swift and it was a swift battle. In the final battle of the war, a general killed the creeper king. I must be on the right track, otherwise this guy wouldn't be down here. Okay. Um, I'm on the other side of the mountain. Alright guys, I'm gonna find my way through. I think I have told you guys enough. really depressing when one of the s strongest and smartest beings you've ever that you have to offer that are on your side gets killed that's really sad and this happened like we're talking about like only a f say like 27 years ago happened only 27 years ago. Ah, oh, man. I was... I wasn't even born yet. I was born, like, 10 or 12 years ago. And I'm 46. At least that's what I am in pig years. But, anyway, guys... I think I have to press myself out quite a bit. So, I'm going to see you guys in the next episode. Um, hopefully I'll be stealing all this gold from, um, from the, the Navy. And, um, then I'm gonna burn down their ships and leave them stranded here. And, um, say they all died in the battle. This way I get all of the money instead of just half of it. And, um... Whoa, what happened there? You know, I'll read the book. I'm gonna read the book. Alright? Sit back. Grab the book. Entry 1. The first bottle was a book. I already read that in the last video. My second bottle was a victory. With only one loss after I got new fresh men. The battle strengthened my men and now we move on Fort Mahoney. Uh, it might 
go on for a night before I can. Last entry, I was interrupted in my ship. An ambush had been laid and we fell for it. They broke a ship with some magic, ice magic. I assume, I don't know, but the next battle will, will be a bad one. Ice magic. Okay. Oh God, I, I, I lost all of my men. I only survived because I hid. They're looking for me now, but I think there's one coming towards me now. Okay, he's gone, but I'll report once I get some bit of hope. The reinforcements just got here. I'm sorry if my spelling is a bit bad, but I'm happy. I'm going to live. I'm going to live. I'm getting out of of hiding but I think he said now he's trying to say now to join rejoin the fight we won we won the battle now I'm in a tent and I'm drinking to my heart's content there's no more battles left I think we've I think we beat the Navy. I'm writing now because I don't know what else to write. I'm getting my armor on. Now there's the Navy. The Royal Navy. I I got to. Remember that guy that I that I shot? When, like, it was, he was right over there. I think this might have been him. Ooh, that's bad. Well, I'm gonna go kill these guys, right? See you in the next episode. Bye.